Welcome back. It's Monday morning. Start of a fresh week. Today, we have got this to finish. Well, not finish. We've got this to even start. We've barely started it. But look at the colours. The colours are looking good. Um, we've got this to do. The customer just turned up over there with another Citroen Relay um, that's got a warranty claim for a Truma. We didn't install the Truma. Another company installed it, they went into liquidation so they had no way of getting it fixed so we've done some repairs on their van that the old company didn't do because um, they don't exist and we found out that there was an issue with the circuit board for the Truma Truma sent us a new one out straight away, they were really good actually I'm big up to um, Truma, this did straight away, they, sent, they knew exactly what problem was maybe it's a common fault, I'm not sure but they knew exactly what the problem was sent us out a new circuit board within a day or two but the customer's now back to have that fitted so I think Lee's going to do that um, Brucey boy is going to be here at some point today I think because we've got a customer coming back for, uh, a customer who had a full van built here he's got an issue with his electrical system I'll fill you in more about that obviously it's nothing to do with us nothing our fault in any way uh, but we're ripping it out and we're putting in a different system that's I'm not messing about there's no trying to bodge things we're ripping the whole thing out literally everything out and starting again all the batteries all, we'll touch on that a bit further I may even do a separate video on it actually because I'm not right happy with it but so Bruce is going to come and start that this is going to be probably going to be a week's job um, so it's going to be me that's cracking on with this I think today we may get Andy back in this week because we've got a few other bits and bobs on um, we've also got some other customers coming for quotes on jobs as well so again a relatively busy week but hopefully it'll be quite entertaining and painless Just starting the uh, vapor barrier stage, having insulated that wall, then we can start carpeting. And uh, Lee, you're just installing that window, aren't you, Lee? Yeah, I'm going to be popping this window in. <laughs> hey! I'm popping that window in there. Yeah. Um, which means then we can carpet that door as well and get that out of the way. Just got to crack on, haven't we? Just got to crack on with this. Yeah, definitely. I actually forgot that we had another customer coming today. Um, the Truma warranty job's done, by the way. Lee just smashed that out very quickly. Um, we had another customer come. Gunnar's, shout out to him. Uh, I've known him a long time. Well, quite a long time. In van life, at SIT, certainly, anyway. I've done some work on a van for him before, years ago. Uh, he's come back for another, an, a different van, wanting a bit of work doing. Uh, I could take it or leave it, that kind of work, but I want to help him out, so we're going to do it uh, hopefully next week. The plan would be to get Andy back in next week and the three of us work on this van and the other van. <laughs> Switching about and that. Bruce went in today, I totally forgot, it's tomorrow is in. But Bob's brought his van to have his electrical system changed, so his van's here. Bruce will be starting that tomorrow. That's, my memory is shocking. Um, oh, I've not told him about the guy. The guy that just came, right? Oh, yeah. So me and Phoenix just went to the sandwich shop. We're walking back from the sandwich shop and this fucking pickup truck pulled in front of us. And this guy got out and I was like, it's a bit strange. And he was like, Liam, I follow you on YouTube. I was like, oh, fucking hell, nice one. And he was like, uh, I've noticed in your videos you've not got any proper dust extraction in your workshop. And we were like, me and him coughing all the time, <laughs> coughing and spluttering all the time. No, we haven't actually. He goes, right, we want to work with you. My company wants to work with you uh, to put your dust extraction system in. Like, 
He didn't look out like Jesus, but he was practically like Jesus. He yeah, came he and gave us. He had a glow around him. Yeah, he had a glow around him. Yeah? Drink. You want a drink? I'll get you a drink in a minute, okay? You got an eating to you got In the cupboard, yeah. You go get one then. Um So he's gonna fit us this dust extracting system for free. Which is fucking mint. Yeah, uh, obviously we're gonna have to plug him in that, but we, why would we not? That's the, just literally what we need in this workshop is a place to get rid of a way to get rid of dust. So knight in shining armor, pick up that guy. Um what a fucking, what a sound guy. Anyway, that's just, just what it's like around here is just fucking crazy. Lots of people coming and going all the time. And then just really kind people just dropping in and doing nice things for us. You can have that one. Because he says I don't make tea, coffee, I'm gonna make a coffee. You tried to put it on what it were on, so there might be some hidden footage Was in there. Was it you? It might have been me. Sneaky bugger. <coughs> right, Lee's fitted that window, which is fucking Bobby Dazzler. Sexy that, isn't it? Uh, and now, Lee. <laughs> Lee doesn't do all the work, I promise. <laughs> now Lee's cutting Skylight all out. Sky Max, 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 Lee's Max. Um, this entire side has now been insulated and vapor barriered. Uh, and the carpet has been smashed on. The carpet's been smashed on up there. And then we're just insulating this. When I say weed, it's just me. Uh, but Lee will open a minute, I'm sure. Well, he might do. That's it. That's all that's been going on today. Tell me why I don't like Mondays. Tell me why I don't like Mondays. Tell me why I don't like Mondays. I'm gonna shoot. The whole day down. Afternoon as well. Yeah, Friday afternoon, yeah. So yeah, it, it, although we've had it a little bit longer. Yeah, exactly, it feels, that's why, like, isn't it? It feels like it's been here a lot long time, but it hasn't. Um, the vape barrier is fully done and uh, the skylight is in. Um, uh, we've run some cable in as well for lights and stuff. Um, Phoenix has just irritated us all day. Daddy, 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 all day long, haven't you? Oh shit, bag! Come here. Okay. What have you, you been? Can open that. Yeah, come here. What have you been saying all day? Daddy, daddy, daddy. Yeah, I know. Yeah, all day long. Because you didn't open that. I opened it like fifty thousand times, and it still wasn't enough. And I can do it. I'm stronger. You are stronger, yeah. Yeah, because I can open that. Because you're Spiderman. So I would not stronger than. Right, Alison. I'm ready for finishing work now. Okay? I'm not finished. It's home time! Okay? I could not bigger. I can't sweep a cupcake. And I would not bigger to get a cupcake. And it's too high. Oh no. Phoenix. And I couldn't get one. That's yours. Thank you. There you go. Where would it? On here. I genuinely, genuinely thought you were getting in your van to drive off then. I genuinely thought that was what was going to happen. Well, it's close. You've got a reputation, haven't you? Why don't you tell them about that time? Tell the camera, come on. Tell the camera about that time when you drove off. What, what do you mean? When we were in Doncaster. <laughs> well, if you, if you cook food for someone, do you expect the plate back clean or dirty? He just, with macaroni cheese all still in it and everything, not completely finished, gives it back to me. Fuck off, clean the thing. That's all I was asking. What did you do? I did 11s. <laughs> he drove off and didn't come back. Did you really? Yeah, I didn't come back. I went fuck off, I'm, I'm out of here. But, but in my defence, I didn't have a sink in my van at the time, so I couldn't wash it. But he didn't stick around long enough for me to say that. <laughs> he just fucked up and didn't come he back. He did say, oh, that was, really, that was really nice, but... He didn't speak Can to you me wash for, it? We did fall out of it a little bit. Really? We didn't speak to each other for a month or two. Was it a month, month or two? Oh, come on, guys. Where's your cup? But, oh, luckily, luckily he's grown up a little bit now. Oh. Luckily he's grown up a little bit now and don't, don't fucking do shit like that anymore. No. No matter how much shit I give you. 
And you do give me a lot of shit, for fuck's sakes. <laughs> I can't stop! Once I start, I can't stop. I love, I love him dearly, but... It's just so much fun winding you up. Where's your you give me shit as well, anyway. Just, anyway, listen. Uh, I put that wall back up. Look at that new fancy light. Uh, that wall's back up now. Uh, Lee's doing the overhead. <laughs> Fuck me! <laughs> What was that? <laughs> Fucking hell! I've grown up a little bit. Do you know what he said? You've grown up a little bit, I thought. Fuck you don't even yeah, fucking know. Man. Where what you, was that? Where did you throw it? Under the bed. Oh, for fuck's sake. Fucking hell! <coughs> I'm gonna have to beep some of these words out. <coughs> Mate, that was best footage. Fucking hell! What was it? It's fucking banger or something. Like a fucking up. You know, like. You're a dick. <laughs> Do you remember you used to be able to get bangers on and then they banned them? It was yeah. like one of them, little bangers. That was loud, man. Nothing, nothing banned, though. That no, scared the crap out of me. Good. Well, <laughs> anyway. <laughs> that, that's I put this wall back together. It's not perfect. That's but equivalent to my lemons. <laughs> That was bad. Farting, but hey, smell it. Oh, it does smell. smell. Yeah, it is a good smell. Oh. Is, it, is it sulfur? Yeah. <coughs> um, yeah, at least doing the overhead storage thing. We've got to make a new thing for it because the template that we have doesn't fit this van. So Lee's made a new one from scratch, which is handy. Uh, we've glued some battens up there to screw that to. Cabling is in for ceiling lights. Um, and tomorrow we'll be going to get some cladding to clad the ceiling and then we can put the ceiling lights in properly which would be ideal uh, other than that I guess I guess once we've done the ceiling then we start on the bed is that right? yeah, bulkhead, ceiling, bed but I'll find it over there let's check these lovely, you know those did those... you slag off my connectors? How good are they? Those shrinky things. Oh, fuck your mouth off. Oh, you should have. It's like, it's like a pixel. Anyway, the reason why like this... Pixar version of a camp... The, the reason why this connect. ball bag is here today is because this is a customer's van that we had. Uh, he's had it back six months now, but he went to Morocco straight after having the van built. Uh, and he had this all singing, all dancing electrical system fitted that weren't cheap. Uh, you might have heard of it. EcoFlow power kit. Now, I love EcoFlow products. Bruce, EcoFlow products are bloody good, aren't they? Yeah. Right? And like I was saying this morning, this product could have been so good. Could have been so good. Could have been so good, but it isn't. Uh, it's had it in six months and it's coming out. But now I wonder if it's just your connections. It can't be, because it's the DC to DC that's not working. Uh, and I've not sold or connected them up. <laughs> <laughs> it's coming out. Uh, uh, the, the, we've just got too pissed off with it now. The customer's really unhappy with it. I'm really unhappy with it. And rather than trying to replace bits and try and get it working, it's just coming out and we're putting a energy system in. Um, lesson learned there, I won't be using that again. Uh, I'm tempted to make a video separately about it, to be honest, a bit more detail, but uh, I don't know if it can be bothered, but yeah, there you go. Mm. Lee, what are you doing? I'm clamping it down. Why? Why? Um, because... Oh, him outside broke tracks so. Bruce. Top truth. Bruce broke the tracks so. Top truth. I didn't break the tracks so. up. Come on! <laughs> it broke while you were using it. The track, no, I just said that it didn't work. And Bruce didn't <laughs> have, Bruce didn't have it didn't work. The tracks was it's three been months made. old. It was November I bought it. And it's done. It's done, mate. Everything's broke today. Everything's it's been a shit day. Today. It has been a shit day. I broke so many things today. <laughs> I broke 300 pounds worth of energy equipment today. Um, I broke two nails, two fingernails. Oh, wow. I broke the drawer that he built in my van. You broke your ears? Yeah, Bruce broke Bruce my ears with that big loud ears. bang, whatever it was. 
and we've not been well i've not been very productive actually i've not really done much work on the van which is annoying it's bruce's fault <laughs> we we work, we are productive normally we are. i think bruce is here today and it's gone to shit so if i put that on sometimes occasionally it says it don't recognize it and it yeah. fucking checks and i don't know if it's just dust or whatever in it <sighs> fucking how, do you, how do you control with the thumb though it's just not not to do you <laughs> no, but i don't i don't i said to set it up and film it <laughs> What are you on, Lee? Uh, we just put an hole in front for the solar cables because we're going to run it from sort of here backwards. Yeah. Yeah. Do it. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, put some lights in the ceiling. Put some cladding. Yeah, we've run out of cladding, but we're going to go out in a bit. We've got to get some supplies anyway. Um, pick up the solar panel, hopefully, as well. 400 water. 400 water. We had a bit of a. A ding dong, let's say. Can we say a ding dong? A ding dong with a customer yesterday. A ding dong. The customer supplied this solar panel, <coughs> a flexible solar panel that's been peeled off the old van to the new one. And there's some clear signs of damage, especially there, uh, and some on the cells. And it's very difficult to explain to some people that that's not, it's not even practical wasting money on sealant to stick that to a roof to then have it not function fully. So. It, it were a long drawn out sort of conversation, but in the end, uh, we've persuaded the customer to get a new solar panel. A bit more solar is always better. That is 130 watts. We've gone for a 400 watt panel and the 400 watt panel is cheaper than what that was. was. So it, it makes sense if you're going to spend money on a van. I know that budgets are tight and that, but if me and Lee say something's a good idea, we're not saying it because we make any money out of it because we bloody don't. We're saying it because we want the best for the customer. So uh, they've, they've, uh, the customer's having to buy a new charge controller uh, to power to have 400 watts of solar, uh, and then they'll not have a problem with charging the batteries. This doesn't have a DC to DC either, which is a bit fucking mad, really, isn't it? Yeah. You'd just stick one in, wouldn't you? But for, for how much they are. Uh, the customers lived a certain way in a van before and that's what they're used to so that's what they're going for that's fine we can only advise but uh, we weren't willing to put that solar panel on I'll be honest we weren't willing to even waste our time putting it on um, it's not worth it not worth putting on so anyway this is what the ceiling's sort of going to look like you get an idea now uh, cladding with there's actually six lights going in but we've run out of cladding for now we'll put the other two at that side uh, and there's going to be more lighting as well. Uh, these cables here are for reading lights and LED lights. Um, so yeah. That's where we're at at the minute. Hopefully this is going to be a quite a painless project from here on. Here on out. Definitely. <laughs> you don't look so sure. <laughs> we'll, we'll, we'll see. <laughs> we'll see. Come on, man. You're, 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 you're making a mess of that. What's on that? He's got eating cheese. I don't know. It's all around his mouth, whatever it is. Supercharge the sauce. You living the dream? I'm living the dream. Why do you look so down? I don't know. Is it shit working? Is, is it wrong to cry on camera? No. I want to cry. It out. Do you know sometimes you just want to cry and then you feel better? Is it really that bad working here? Is it Bruce that's doing your editing? It's Bruce's fault, isn't it? You were happy until Bruce came back. I'm going to let you, you imagine what's wrong. I'm not going to tell you. Right, listen, this is the way things are at the minute. The ceiling's pretty much done. Lights are all in. Uh, the skylight light is on. Put that trim down here, which is a double use really it hides the main join of uh, the ply boards but that's not its main purpose uh, it's gonna have LED lights that run underneath it uh, but just the height I've put it does hide that seam which makes everything look ten times better than it was 
Uh, we didn't really get round to starting bed today, but I think that that could be on the cards for tomorrow, couldn't it? Gonna have to. <laughs> to yeah, we've got to. We're two weeks in now, aren't we? No, we're not. We are not. We're a week in. Yeah, it'll be a full week. <laughs> yeah, we'll, there, we'll work hard next week. There was a point when we said, we've only done a, a day and a half. Day and we've half got ready yeah, for it. And then we've done fuck all since then. Whoop. That's where we are anyway. It's looking good. I'm optimistic. <laughs> How's it? How's it? How are you? Well, don't pretend to be fucking nice. Because camera's out. <laughs> oh, well, it's, 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 I'm working in here today because it's fucking nice and warm. It is nice and warm. The heat here is on today. It's a chilly day. Lee's still ill. This is like week 17, isn't it? <laughs> it is, isn't it? It's week 17, Lee really. being ill. Uh, yesterday we built this little bench here. Uh, mainly to house the chop saw. That's a permanent place for the chop saw now. Because of this dust extraction system thing that this guy messaged us about, or the guy came in about, I wanted a permanent place for that. So now we've got a permanent place for that. We've got a new place to put cable and hang cable up, as you can see. A new place to charge power banks. However, I didn't do a very neat job of putting everything back. So now the entire workshop is full of crap. So, today's plan is, we've started the bed. We're going to do the bed today, and then we're going to clean the entire place up out of the roots. Yeah. Uh, not okay. We're going to, we're going to tidy up out of the roots. Do you no. ever do any tidy up? No. No, no you don't. Just leaves the place a mess. Anyway, that's the plan today. So we're going to get cracking with that. And then, it's Friday, so we're, we're not going to be here late today. It's been a long, it's been a long week, hasn't it? It's been a long week. Oh. It's been a long week and not a lot's got done. Like... It's been very uh, long for me. There you go, the, the charger's run out on the power bank so the heat's not on anymore. We did install the LED lights on this side but we had three sets of LED lights fail. Um, so we're waiting on another set to go down this side. It's nice up. Right. Right. Bit of progress today. Uh, Wonder Boy. Oh, we've not painted them. Uh, Wonder Boy has done the carpet in uh, and the ply down there. We need to paint them to match the back ones, uh, and then put the window frame on. And that's that side of the van done. So it is looking good now. Since we put this uh, ply on here, it's made it look a whole lot better down that side and then same on this side but the biggest change today is that the bed's about done and you can see what it's going to look like with the spotlights there and it's got the leds that run along here to that can change color and all that business Ugh. uh we've got to build a front for the bed but it's going to have a cabinet on this side i'm happy with that to be fair i'm happy with progress today uh, we've had a lot of customers coming today as well, a lot of customers, probably three or four customers wanting a lot of work done uh, and some interesting projects as well actually which I, I'm, I'm, I'm excited to get my teeth into, hopefully uh, they'll come off very soon um, but we've got at least one full van build confirmed today uh, and then some part work as well. It's Friday so that's it for this video but come Monday Monday and Tuesday and is back in because we're dead busy Monday. Tuesday's gonna be quite busy. Bruce is still not finished. I don't mean that in a derogatory way. He's not finished the crafter yet, but he's working tomorrow, which is gonna be Saturday, obviously, because it comes back to Friday. But I'm gonna be in tomorrow as well, uh, pottering about doing some bits, tidying the workshop, uh, and getting things ready for Monday because it is gonna be busy. Thanks again for watching. Um, thanks for all the support, and I'll see you on next one. Have a good one, bye Felicia.